We will now demonstrate how to isolate, produce inoculum and inoculate plants within common mosaic virus. This is a virus disease. The procedures that will be shown are different from what is done for fungal and bacterial pathogens. To carry out this procedure, you will need the following. A glass flask, a funnel, cheesecloth or cotton wool, measuring cylinder, a sterile mortar and pestle, acid washed sand, sterile phosphate buffer, carborandum powder, cotton sticks, and the infected plant material, which is, which is stored on either ice, or you may also use ice blocks. You will also need a weigh balance to weigh the plant material. Weigh the leaf material. In this case, we weigh two grams. Weigh out 10 mils of phosphate buffer. Phosphate buffer is added at a rate of one gram of leaf tissue per five mils of the phosphate buffer. In this case, we add 10 mils for two grams of leaves. Pour this into the sterile mortar and add the leaf material. Add acid washed sand to the leaf material and start crushing. Save the leaf material using either cheesecloth or cotton wool. Rinse off the excess plant material using phosphate buffer and pour into the sieve. The inoculum is now ready. You may either put it on ice or keep it in the refrigerator until you require it. Plug the flask with cotton wool and you might then put it on ice or keep it in the refrigerator. Add a small amount of the carbaronum powder in the micro, to the microfiber bottle and make a sprinkler by using cheesecloth to help you spray small amounts of the powder on two bean leaves that are to be inoculated. Use the sprinkler to powder 10 day old plants with the carbaronum powder. Or you might use a multiple needle as described in the Seat manual. Get your virus inoculum from the ice and using the cotton stick dip into the inoculum and rub smoothly over the leaf surface. By doing this the carborandum has injured the plant tissue and the virus is able to infect the leaf.